Hey guys, what's good? It's your girl Shanice. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and join the gang. And if you are not new, what's good? What's popping? Welcome back, family. So as you can see by the title of this video, I'm going to be doing my go-to makeup routine, sort of like a get ready with me, even though we don't really have anywhere to go because we are quarantining or we are social distancing. But your girl has to work, so here we are. And a lot of you guys have been requesting this video from me. You guys really wanted me to go in depth with the products and all that, so that's what I'll be doing today. And I wanna shout out today's sponsor, which is Haley's Beauty. I came across their products a while ago and I'm in love, mainly because their products really focus on the skin. They are natural, they are vegan, they're cruelty free. And to mention, it's actually a female chemist who formulates all of the products, so girl power. And if you guys are interested in any of the Haley's products I'll be using, there is a memorial sale going on for 20% off. And if you use my coupon code, you get an extra $5. So check the link in the description box and let's finally get into this video. Okay, so I already did my eyebrows off camera and it was a struggle because I have not done my eyebrows in forever. So they are real, they are real bushy right now, but it's okay. Okay, so first off, I'm gonna start off with a primer. This is the Fine Face Primer by Haley's Beauty. It contains vitamin C. C, which is great for brightening and evening the skin tone and y'all know I'm all about that even in my skincare routine videos brightening and evening skin tone all of that is everything for me it also helps to blur out any fine lines or pores and really just smooths out the skin and it feels really good it's like this silky type this silky type of um feeling I feel like my eyes need some because they're so oily. <laughs> okay, so next I'm gonna go in with the Reform Liquid Luxe Foundation and I'm in the shade 7.25. And they also do have a foundation stick or contour stick. Pretty much I use both of these. It just really depends on the look that I'm going for. If I'm really having one of those like kind of no makeup makeup days, I will go in with the stick and literally just get my dark marks and to just even up my skin tone. But if I want like a more full coverage, flawless type face i'll go in with the foundation so i just like to dot this all over my skin i don't really like to apply a lot just just enough so i'm literally like barely pumping anything and if i have to add more i will so i'm actually going to be using their sponge as well which is super super soft to blend this out Can y'all see how smooth this just applies and how it blends out perfectly? I feel like it just makes my skin look even better. <laughs> Gives me some color, evens my skin tone. That's literally how I like my makeup to look. It does say on the website that it contains spherical powder, which is known for smoothing out the skin and giving you like that IG filter type look so as you can see i feel like it definitely does that for me and that's why it's like my go-to right now y'all don't mind my nails but now i'm gonna go in with Haley's vibe concealer and this is in the shade let's see medium tan warm so this also contains the same spherical powder which helps to smooth out wrinkles fine lines all of that which is great for under eyes because i feel like that's one of the most wrinkliest parts of somebody's face because there's so many just little lines so i don't like to put a lot of concealer just just enough then i'm gonna let that sit there and then i'm gonna contour i've been using ColourPop's contour stick this is in deep dark this also blends out really really nicely i haven't been going too ham with it a little bit on the forehead just a little bit and then i'm gonna go in with this angled brush right here and kind of just press it in
So to blend out the concealer, I'm gonna also use the sponge. Okay, so next up I'm going to set my face. So I'm going to be using Sephora Collection. This is their Micro Smooth Powder in Deep. This is an all-time favorite of mine. Love this for setting. It just it really makes your skin even smoother. So I'm going to apply that. All over. And then I take a smaller taper type brush swirl that in there and then I also get my eyes and this kind of just tones down the concealer if you don't really like the bright look which for my everyday I don't really do such a bright look but my next step I'll show you I like to use a lighter kind of golden yellow powder this one is actually from range beauty I'm just gonna place this under the eye just for some brightness. I'm gonna pack it in. Okay, so for contour, which is one of my favorite parts, we are gonna be using the one and only Fenty Beauty Sun Stalker Bronzer in Mocha Mami. And we are going to bronze the cheeks. Y'all see that? This is my favorite part especially during summer like you just cannot go wrong and it looks like you just came back from a beach you just came back from a vacation and that's the look that I always go for y'all always ask me about you know how I look so glowy so this is how I kind of get like the all year bronze type vacation vibe look just bronzing up and and using products that really bring out um, my skin I take the same bronzer and just Use a little flush, fluffy brush and then wipe that over my eyes. Just to give it some color and definition. So when it comes to highlighting, I actually drifted away from it. I don't know why, I'm just not into that super, super, super glowy look anymore. Cause I sometimes I just feel like I look too too sweaty or too oily or something. I don't know, I'm just not really into it anymore. I like more of that just subtle type of glow. So I'm gonna be using Maybelline's Master Chrome. Super, super beautiful. This is in Molten Topaz. I'm gonna kind of take this fluffy brush right here. I literally just, not a lot at all. And lightly brush it onto my cheeks, like, Literally not a lot. Same thing, just do that on my nose, just a little bit. Literally forgot, I'm actually gonna be using some blush. This is Sephora Collection Blush in Peach Blossom. It's like this orangey, peachy type color. And it's pretty subtle as well so that's what I like about it onto the eyes again I keep it real real simple we're gonna be using NYX's um, liquid eyeliner this is my favorite eyeliner out there right now and then I'm gonna be applying some falsies this is the number F810 alrighty y'all so I'm gonna use some mascara to blend in my lashes with the falsies oh my gosh I hate when this happens and what on my nose Okay, let me wait till it dries. Do my lower lashes. Um, I'm gonna do my waterline. Just this is just a thing that I've been doing now, and I absolutely love it. For some reason I feel like it makes my eyes look browner, like more of like a light brown. Well, let me not say light brown, just more brown. In the meantime, let's just do my lips. So I like to use either Shayla ColourPop Lippy Pencil um, or I like to use Chestnut by MAC. So we are gonna use Chestnut by MAC today.
my lip colors have not changed y'all it's this is bite beauty in power move any type of nude pinky kind of color will work And then to make it more pale, because I don't really like it to be too pink, I'm going to use Fenty Gloss Balm in Diamond Milk. Let me see what I'm going to do about this now. Can I scratch it off? I don't know. I'm trying to scratch it off. Okay, so we are pretty much done. We just have to set the face. So I'm going to be applying Max Fix Plus as well as Urban Decay All Nighter Setting Spray um, just to take away the powdery look. Okay, guys, so I'm pretty much done. I'm going to take down my hair and then I will be back. Okay guys, so I am back and this is my final look. So this is literally my go-to makeup look, my everyday makeup look, my makeup face when I wanna put on a full beat or full foundation look. Um, this is what I do, this is how I do it. So hopefully you guys enjoy this video. But before I leave, I do have some exciting news. We are doing a giveaway, giveaway. Mm. So there are going to be 20 winners. You do have to go over to my Instagram page. You will be winning all of the Haley's Beauty products that I use in this video. So the foundation, the primer, the concealer, all of that you'll be winning. So it's a big giveaway and there's going to be a lot of winners. So definitely check the description box to see how you can enter and how you can win. It does close on May 28th. Again, if you guys are interested in any of the products that I use, specifically Haley's Beauty, I will leave a link down below. And hopefully you guys enjoy this video and I will see you all in the next one. Love you guys. Deuces.